Within the graph data spreadsheet are several different ways that you can work with data. To enter a new data value, select a cell, type a value, and hit enter. This will automatically move to the next one down. You can also enter a value and use one of the arrow keys to move between adjacent cells. To delete a value from a cell, simply select it and hit the delete key. Along the top of the data dialog box are some handy keys. You can use the import data button to import a comma or tab delimited data source from the hard drive. Illustrator can recognize text files and Excel files. You can also copy and paste data from another source. For example, here I have a document in Excel showing high and low temperatures for an entire month. If I copy these values, then I can select the place where I want this to be pasted and paste them in. I can also expand and move the data window as needed to see all of the values. By default, the data labels are located along the top row, and the category labels are located down the first column. But I can use this button right here to transpose rows and columns. This will change my categories to my data labels and vice versa. If the graph is specified as a scatter graph, I can also use this button to switch the X and Y values. This button right here is used to change the cell style. Using this, I can change the cell width and the number of decimal places that are displayed. I can use this button as an undo button to return to a previous look. Once I'm happy with the changes, I can click on the apply button to update the graph.